Every season, your investment and energy is targeted on one goal, higher yields, and one feeling, pride. Pride Seeds delivers higher yields to help you reach that goal. Pride, one company. Experience the advantage. Hi, it's Dan Foster, market development agronomist for Pride Seeds for the deep southwest of Ontario. Coming to you today from a cornfield in Chatham, uh, planted on May the 6th. So we're looking at corn that's at basically the three-leaf stage pushing four. What I'd really like to talk about today is the fact that uh, this field needs to be sprayed. Um, we've got some, some broad leaves and some grasses that are coming along. This field didn't have any pre-emerge uh, herbicide at all. And being that this corn's in a sensitive stage at that three leaf, it is time to spray. Now, we have had some adverse weather conditions with a lot of moisture where there hasn't been a big opportunity to get in and spray. Um, but it is time to be in here and spray in, uh, whether we do just a Roundup, being it's a Roundup Ready Field or a glyphosate. Um, but it'd be nice to have some residual to go in with this. Um, I'm a big proponent of going into a cornfield with a pre-emerge uh, fertilizer and using that glyphosate as a rescue later on. We're looking at some velvet leaf, some lamb's quarters, um, some foxtails, some prozo millet, um, and a little bit of, of possible crabgrass that's that's really on its way. We're in probably the dirtiest spot in the field, but a, but a really good uh, good view of what you don't want to have, and you don't want these weeds getting much bigger than we have right now, or we're not going to have as good a control with uh, with the herbicide. And being that the corn will be setting its its yield potential by five leaf stage, really five six leaf stage setting that cob in there. Um, this is a crucial, crucial time to make sure that we're in a clean situation in this field. So we've got a, a very good stand. We're, we're through the weather. We're into good weather going forward. So uh, this grower is going to get out here and spray, hopefully today, if not today, tomorrow, and not really leave it any longer. Uh, you can see on the plants there on that first leaf that came out, there was a little bit of frost damage um, from when it was emerging there about a week ago, a little bit longer, we had some, some cooler weather here. And you can see a little bit of, of uh, leaf tip burn and water soak looking, uh, which is from the frost, but really didn't affect it at all. So it's very crucial that we get our herbicide program figured out and done ahead of time. If not, ahead of time, shortly thereafter emergence. Uh, this has been Dan Foster, market development agronomist for Pride Seeds, coming to you today from south of Chatham in a beautiful cornfield planted May the 6th.